good morning dear students and welcome to e module created by netaji subhas mahavidyalay huldibadi coach bihar now i will discuss about the summary the gist of basti Basti was written in the year 1979 by Intijar Hussain and first it was written in Urdu language later on it was translated in English it is said in 1971 when war clouds were looming large in the Indian subcontinent the new country of pakistan is no longer fresh and pure and hopeful but soiled away and weary and entirely without hope and news from distant east pakistan is ominous the forceful imposition of urdu language on the people of east pakistan created a dilemma and it was on the verge of being separated basti's protagonist jakir has already faced own tumult that of 1947 when he left india and did the hijrat or migration to the land of the pure that is pakistan after the first luminous day spent walking the streets of the new city lahore that ought to be his home savoring the delight of walking about freely without the fear that someone will slip a knife into his ribs soaking in the sights soaking in the new sights and sounds and smells jakir stage awake all night weeping and remembering the city the streets the sounds and people he has left behind i quote the lines from the book that day seemed very pure to him with its night with its with the tears of its night but and quote but those days of innocence and goodness and large heartedness of the new people in the new land united not so much by own religion but by common loss and the feeling of homelessness slip away after that the days gradually grew soiled and dirty perhaps it is always like this gradually the goodness and sincerity leaches out and in its place there is greed corruption and intolerance looking back jaki reflects those were good days good and sincere i want to remember those days or in fact i want to write them down for fear i should forget them again and the days after word then too so i can know how the goodness and sincerity gradually died out from the days how the days came to be filled with misfortune and nights with ill omen slowly the vigor of building a new nation in pakistan 
begins to say when jakir can see nothing ahead of him in the future both of him and his country seems bleak and unpromising jakir sits of background through the thickets of his memories he crosses the vast forest of time and travels backward to rupnagar a place at once mythic and real a place of enchantment and danger that he has left behind in a country that remains forever nameless dear students rupnagar you can understand the meaning a village of beauty actually it is a utopian land an imaginary land dear students who have read the writings of r k narayan knows it very well that his malguri is a imaginary land an utopian land it does not actually exist throughout the world but it is the brain child of the writer himself dear students i will add several such small videos one by one telling the gist or summary of basti thank you